Hello again, this is Robert Veach here. This is my video review of a three gang rocker switch panel from the company XH Technology, 12 volts or 24 volts. Has five pin on and off car switches, has blue LED, we're gonna show that. You can use this on automobiles, cars, Jeeps, trucks, anywhere you wanna switch anything that can uh, be switched with DC current at 12 or 24 volts. Now each one of these switches can handle 20 amps at 12 volts or 10 amps at 24 volts. So each one is 20 amps, so that's 60 amps this could be switching. Make sure that your input can provide that, that current. Whatever you can provide on the input is gonna be divided by the three. You gotta keep that in mind. And uh, this has got some interesting uh, qualities to this product. It's made of a premium aluminum material, not plastic. These are very sturdy switches and I tested them out already and they'll give you really long service life on there. And it has each, of an, each individual switch has two flexible PC buckets, keep toggle switches on the panel tighter and allows you to mount this to your panel. And you can see that you've got these three uh, plastic pieces on each side and that will lock this in place when you put it in service. And the normal operation is these little squares go on the top and the bottom LEDs will light up letting you know which one you are switching on. When you switch it on, it should come on. And we're gonna uh, wire this up and we're gonna test this out so that you can see exactly how this works. Now the cutout size is 3.03 inches long by 1.75 wide. The panel size is 3.96 inches long by 2.68 wide. And the material is copper and PC board and aluminum. I should say a copper PC board and aluminum. And as I mentioned, 12 to 24 volts. And the operating temperature is minus 13 to 149 degrees Fahrenheit. So um, the instruction little sheet right here does tell you how to basically wire it up. And uh, it also includes the mounting screws that you're gonna need to go through the four panel holes right there. And these little stickers, which are totally clear, see-through. Now the camera's not gonna pick these up, but I was looking with a uh, ultraviolet light and there is every symbol imaginable that you could use to place on these little square sections right here to have them light up. So you're gonna have a lot of choices on there. You'll be able to pick whatever you want, whether it's a floodlight or anything, a pump, uh, an auxiliary motor, a windshield wiper, it's gonna have it in those sticker panels there. Now just looking at the back of this, you could see that you have a plus wire and a minus wire. This is gonna to go to your auxiliary switch and again, provide as much current as you can to this. It is to go to your minus your battery or your car body ground. And then you'll notice that there's three terminals right there that are silver. That is the output terminals on there. And it is an industry standard size. So I'm gonna be wiring this up and showing you, I'm gonna be using these connectors right here, and I'm gonna be placing them on those there. So here I'm gonna demonstrate the operation. Here I have a power supply, and I'm simulating what you have in your car, about 13.9 volts or so, with your alternator running. And then here's the unit, and you can see I just simply powered it with the minus to the minus and the plus to the plus, which is coming from that power supply right there. And then you can see on the display right there that it has the bottom LEDs illuminated. And now the top ones, when you click the switch forward, will light up also. Now we're gonna show you, I'm gonna wire up a couple, of this, a couple different accessories to this by using those three wires that I added to the terminal block right on the bottom there of each one of the outputs of those switches. Again, remember they can handle 20 amps each at 12 volts. So here I have it wired up to control two, I'm using two of the switches. I have two LED floodlights or fog lights right there. And I have the power supply coming in like I showed. 
and the negative of both of those are wrapped together going to the negative and that's going to go to your car ground or your negative or your battery positive goes into the panel and then those output wires that i showed earlier each one goes to each individual light we're not using this one here for this demonstration so you go like that and you can see the one light coming on and then the other one comes on just like that or both of them and it's nice because you can visually see what power is going to your accessories on your car, your truck, your RV, or your boat. Wherever you're going to use this on is very effective. So after testing this product out, and I'll show you how it's all wired, what's my overall opinion about this product, this rocker switch panel, the 3 Gang from XH Technology. I think this is a great value. This feels like high quality. The switches are high quality. I love the way it looks, the aluminum on here. This is not going to bend. This is very rigid and these are very strong switches, handling a lot of current, probably tested for a million operations. You can't go wrong. I'm gonna give this product a full five-star rating. Please remember to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon so you're alerted to new video uploads. And if you like this review, please hit the like button. I hope the information I presented helped you with all your buying decisions. Thanks for watching.